Heightened construction costs in Williamson County is causing city leaders to rethink a 2019 voter approved bond proposal. So they're now scaling back several parks and recreation projects. KXAN's Caitlin Carmoot shows us how they plan to save millions. I'm going to explore a little bit, uh, maybe set up camp under one of the trees. In Williamson County, the parks are loved by many. The voters uh, approved our bond in November of 2019. So much so that the Parks and Rec director helped push forward the $35 million bond in 2019. Many of those projects completed, some under construction, and a few on hold for now. It's not uncommon at all that we have to reduce scope or, or make some modifications. Fishback says this year's cost adjustments are far more drastic. At Champion Park in Cedar Park, the wildflowers, they're here to stay. The county would have expanded the parking lot to add 30 new spots, but those have since been cut. Originally looking at about 75 parking spaces and some upgrades to our lighting. Looking now at reducing that scope approach, only 45 spaces. At Berry Springs in Georgetown, the county will cut a proposed RV site and new visitor center and a restroom improvement project at the Southwest Williamson County Regional Park is also scaled back. So all in those three locations, we're estimating that our, our overage would be about a half a million dollars at this point with our reduced scope. Uh, originally, if we were to do all phases uh, and all projects at those three locations, we would be over budget uh, about $2.3 million. But the goal isn't to cut these projects altogether. Fishbeck is optimistic the cost will go down. Who knows what's going to happen in the future, but hopefully this is the unprecedented period and that we're going to see leveling off and maybe even some reversal to some degree. Kate Carmo, KXAN News.